Hi, in this video, I'm going to explain you how you can actually do a Zoom, uh, whatever live session you are doing, how you can do it on uh, FB live as well. So that's what I'm going to show so that you can directly do this live streaming on Facebook as well. Okay, so that's what uh, we are going to learn. And uh, for that, I have already created a test Zoom Facebook live uh, meeting. Uh, if you don't know how to create a meeting, then there is a link below in the description. Just click on that and you should be able to uh, learn how to create a meeting or a webinar. Okay. So for doing uh, a Zoom live on Facebook, there are a couple of settings that we need to do. Okay. So first thing that you need to do is just go to settings. So this is applicable for meetings. Okay. For webinar, there is a different setting which I am going to explain. So please do make sure that you are going to watch till the end so that you don't miss anything. Go to settings. And in the setting, just search for live. Okay. Just search for live and it will show you like uh, allow live streaming meetings. Okay. This has to be turned on. Once you turn on, you can see that Zoom allows you to uh, do the live streaming to Facebook, Workplace by Facebook, YouTube, and also custom live streaming services also available. So I'm going to explain about custom live streaming service in the next video. So what this actually does is like, uh, say for example, you want to uh, schedule a Facebook live or something. That means you are uh, keeping that for uh, not immediately, maybe after a couple of days or whatever it could be. In that case, you can actually do that where the moment you start the Zoom meeting, it is also going to start the Facebook live streaming as well. So which is actually a very good feature. There are a couple of settings for that, which I'm going to explain in the next video. Now for for us right now, where like we are already in the meeting and we want to do a live streaming. So just make sure that this is selected. Okay. And uh, Facebook is selected. Make sure you just select everything. And once you have done with this, just go back to meetings. And then just click on start. Let me just open uh, zoom meeting. So one other thing is like while we are doing uh, uh, from Zoom to Facebook live streaming, I have noticed that there is uh, roughly around 15 to 20 seconds of delay. Whatever uh, uh, people who are watching on Facebook, they might be seeing a little bit delay, but that's still okay, I would say. So let me just open. Now you could see that uh, when you click on the more option, you see fa go, uh, live on Facebook. Only because we went on the settings and we made that uh, settings turned on, we are able to see that. If you are not able to see that, see this settings, just make sure you are going to settings and turning on that feature. Okay. So now you can actually go on, uh, go live on Facebook. Okay. So you uh, have the option to mute or uh, turn on your video and things like that. Okay. So right now I can't turn on because it's already recording. So let me just click on uh, live on Facebook. The moment you click on this. It is going to give you multiple options where actually you want to go live. Okay. So it says uh, choose where you want to post your live video. Uh, either you can say uh, share on your on a friends timeline, share on in a group, share in an event. I want to share on my page that I manage. So I'll just select this. Now once you do that, it is going to list all the pages that uh, you are admin for it. And let's say for example, okay, I want to do it on uh, this page. Okay. So I'll just click on next. So once you do that, it is preparing live streaming uh, preview. So it might take a couple of seconds. Now actually you can give a title here, say for example, uh, test Facebook live from zoom. Okay. So that's what I want to say. And uh, I'll say this. And all you need to do is just hit go live and you're going to see that it is live. Okay. So this is how exactly you do a Facebook live with whatever zoom meeting that you are doing, uh, you can do along with that as well. Okay. Just by click of that uh, one button where you say go live, you can do that. So this is how you do for meetings. Now I'm going to tell you how you can do for webinars as well. Okay. So I'm not going to just click on go live right now. So I'm just going to disconnect this. Uh, let me just uh, end this meeting. End meeting for all. So the moment I do that, you can see that, okay, sorry, we are having trouble playing this video. So that's fine. And again, I'll go to zoom. 
So now I'm going to show you how to do the same thing for a webinar because for webinar uh, also we need to do the similar settings but the settings are in a different uh, uh, options. So now for webinar if you're doing a webinar and you want to do live streaming on Facebook in that case you need to go to account management go to account management then click on webinar settings okay so earlier we did the meeting settings now this is webinar settings so just scroll down and you'll be seeing in stream settings okay so, so just click on edit and uh, select allow host to live stream their webinar once you do this you can see that you again have the all the same features only that are listed so let me just click on uh, save changes so that's done now i have created a test webinar i'm going to show you how to do that so test webinar so let me just click this start button open zoom meeting okay so that's done now if i click on more you can again see live on facebook so that's how actually you do for webinar okay the only difference is the settings are in a different place that's it other than that everything is same thanks for watching i hope this was useful in the next video i am going to create how you can actually uh, schedule a zoom meeting in facebook that means uh, you can plan for the later day the moment you start your zoom meeting it's also going to live stream on facebook so that's what the video i'm going to create in the next video so make sure you're going to watch that and also let me know if you have any queries related to zoom i'll be happy to answer that so thank you very much if you're not already subscribed to the channel then subscribe and hit that bell notification see you in the next video